when removing the sample, you just do the reverse action here. There's a little notch up here and we'll slide down in one of these two slots depending whether you're inserting or removing a sample, which is marked on the front face here. And now that we are done aligning, I will then put in my sample here that I would like to polish. Again, this little um, hole goes in the front, rotate until it falls in place, and then rotate back to zero. So now to set the correct height, when doing a cross section, the height is always uh, correct. But when you're doing a planar polish, the sample height will vary. So you push the button, we get an understanding of where the sample is. So that means the sample is too high. And there's a little LED light here that, with the sensor. So we need to lower. It's held by a set screw. And now we can follow these lights to get to, right now it's on yellow, which means it's a little bit out of place. We want to be in the green. Okay, so now we're in the green, tighten the set screw back. And now just like loading the alignment sample, we will now load this sample. Loosen the set screw, lower the shaft, pick up the sample, and now we're ready to insert sample.